So today I will show you how to make a excellent sturdy deck box for your magic cards. And a box like this can hold approximately at least 100 single sleeve cards. Less double sleeve cards, obviously. With the lid as the locking mechanism. So let's get started. We need a milk box or a use use box, a pair of scissors, a pen, and a kind of ruler. So first thing we're gonna do is take a sleeve card and measure out on our box the height of it. This is the front, and this is the back. So, let's do like this. And you, then you draw a straight line. So the first step is to cut out this piece. And once that is done, you will cut the sides in the same height as the card in the, uh, or as the back, like this. So you can fold it open. Then your box will look like this. And once you have it like this, you fold the box over, and then you make draw a line where the box meets the front portion but of the inside of the box approximately you're gonna fold it here where you where, the, where you made a mark Okay, now it looks like this. And then take off the, the lid. And then if you fold it over, you can see where the lid meets the back panel here. And then you make a mark, approximately where it is. And we're gonna cut out this circle. And once <clears throat> once you have the hole, you you're gonna cut this back panel up along along these sides so it's only holding together here in the back. Now you can trim the hole because you want a hole to be able to go over the the lid here. So then I see how much I need to trim. Okay, <clears throat> now we're gonna 
cut along this line and also here and what we're gonna do later is we're gonna glue it gonna glue this thing together where we fold up the sides like this and then you can just go like this and there we have the box but we're not quite there yet and so first I'm gonna trim the sides of like this so it's even And so, uh, since we're gonna use a glue gun to glue this thing together, we need to sandpaper uh, some of the um, some of the areas here to get the glue to stuck. Yes, the little yes, the big glue sticks. And every side that's going to be glued needs, needs to be sandpapered. Okay. Now we're gonna load up, heat up the glue gun, and then we can put this thing together. Okay, so now I've heated up the glue gun. And remember to walk cautiously, because this shit is hot. And then we just glue it together. And if you don't have a glue gun, I guess you could use any other type of um, adhesive that would set quickly, but uh, the charm with this one is it sets uh, extremely quickly and um, it's very easy to work with. So if you don't have one of these at home, I can recommend that you buy one just because you could fix all sorts of stuff with this one. I bought uh, this glue gun for ten, approximately $10. So. Um, it's very a well worth investment. So there's only two sides to, to glue and then we're actually done. I'm just gonna hold it for a second to set properly and there we have it a box which can close and you can lock it you're supposed to lock it I should make the hole a little bit bigger I think but then you can lock it like this and if you want you can decorate it, but I mean, I prefer the aesthetics of these boxes. And you can round off or trim some of the edges. Never buy a deck box again. This is cheap, sturdy, 
very functional and um, you can never have enough you can make as money as you want so good luck <laughs>